Hi everyone, welcome to today's video. Today we would be understanding a very important um, candlestick pattern, which is also known as doji. So what exactly is a doji? It's a single candlestick pattern, which generally says that if it's a, uh, so it generally has a very, very uh, slim body. And so either it could be this pattern or you could have something like so let's understand the psychology, uh, market psychology behind doji patterns. So what exactly a doji pattern says? Okay, so these are the two kind of doji patterns. Uh, so what exactly a doji pattern says? A doji pattern says that there's a trend reversal which could be occurring in a particular market. Um, let's try to analyze why. Uh, what exactly is happening in a doji pattern is that generally the buyers and sellers are at an equilibrium what is an equilibrium that they both are trying to push the market price in one direction now suppose that it was a green trend before and suddenly a doji appears what can you say about this particular doji you can see that the sellers are actually trying to push the price down um, from this particular point and the buyers are actually trying to push the price upwards from this particular point therefore there is a, a very little gap between the uh, open price and the close price so therefore you can expect that the market is trying to decide the direction or this particular share is trying to decide the direction of its movement so therefore doji pattern becomes a very important pattern because from here you can see that okay if a doji pattern is formed what is the direction of market in which uh, it is going, um, you know, maybe it is. it might be going upward from here or it might be going downwards from here. Similarly for uh, the red doji pattern as well. But it's a very important pattern to understand in which side the market uh, will be going. Now, uh, this doji pattern, there are different kind of doji patterns which are formed, which you will subsequently learn in other uh, lectures um, where you can see that, okay, the price... Uh, you know, the doji is something like it, but the upper wick is, you know, um, very big wick and the lower wick is very small little wick over here. So, you know, this kind of pattern or you can see some pattern like this where the upper wick is very small and the lower wick is very large. So, we'll understand the psychology behind those as well. But this is what a basic doji pattern actually looks like. Now, let's look at some of the doji patterns that... Uh, I have pulled up for us. Let me clear the drawings. And okay. So here's one of the doji pattern that you can see. Actually, there are a lot of doji patterns which can which we can spot. So look, uh, we have one over here where we have a very small body. So market was deciding over here. So you see that there was an uptrend. Then this particular trend changed and there was a downtrend. In fact, let's spot other dozies as well. So you can expect this to be a doji. You can expect this guy to be a doji. Then you can expect this guy to be a doji. You can expect this guy to be a doji. Similarly, I see a doji over here. I see a doji over here. It's not that always when a doji is getting formed, the market is, you know, reversing. But it, it could be an indicator that, okay, the market is now trying to decide in which direction is it going to be. So we'll subsequently learn about uh, more dojis in the upcoming videos. But that's all for this video. And I'll see you guys in the next.